Finally, I have you back. Did you run into a chaos infusion or something? Yeah, but don't worry about it. I'm fine. I'm glad to hear that. Oh, and Vanille was looking well. Don't you think so? Hope, is it me or do you sound happy? Does someone have a little crush? What are you talking about, Light? Of course not. All thanks to the hype. Embarrassing. Me and Fang? We woke up 13 years ago. Lumina was the one that found us back then. All confused. You can imagine why. We were asleep in Crystal for a thousand years after all. Maybe even longer than that. You know, a lot of people died because of what we did in the past. I think that's why we were called back. To make amends. We were brought back for the end of the world, to pay our debts, but we needed you. The world did. I've been waiting all these years for you to come back to us, Lightning. The Savior's coming means that the end is finally here. I'll get to rest in peace at last. It will all be over. It's been such a long time. Feng used to live here too when we woke up. But she left for my sake, to find an ancient relic of the gods, something I desperately need before the end comes. The Holy Clavis. It's somewhere in the dead dunes, and we have to have it before the last day. She knows that. I thought she'd be back in no time, but the day stretched into weeks, into months. And now it's been years. She never came back in all that time, not even once. I know that she said she didn't like the order much, that much was for certain. Or maybe she's just given up on me. <laughs> it seems like Fang's having a good time, though. My bit of crystal shows me that much, at least. I'm glad that she's out there somewhere, living. Laughing. I'm the one who's been given the means to atone for what we did, not Fang, not anyone else, so I have to. I have to pay for our sins. Light. You have to be in the Ark at 6 o'clock every morning to regulate the time distortion. What is it? I've heard what they say about me. The people see me as some kind of curiosity. They call me a saint, and they say that I can talk to chaos. <laughs> but I'm no saint. I can't talk back to the voices. Only listen. When I woke up, I could feel them in the chaos the dead and hear their cries of pain. I want to do something with this power I was given. That's why I've stayed here, within the cathedral's walls. I'm not a prisoner. Really, I'm not. This is what I've chosen for myself. I won't leave. I was given this power so I could atone to the dead. I want to do that. I owe them that. But I still need one more thing before I can. That's why I chose to stay, and work with the Order. They can get me what I need, to atone. What is it? I want to see them every day, but I can't. Saz left the cities and is living quietly out somewhere in the wilds, Lumina says. Snow's the patron now, and he can't just leave Yusnan. And Hope, he disappeared years and years ago. None of us know where he went. Hope was a leader of the people, way back when the chaos began enveloping the entire world. He's the one who kept society together. But then he just disappeared. It was almost worse than if he'd never been there at all. People panicked. Some people think that God summoned him back to his side, but that's just hope. <laughs> Wishful thinking. 
Everyone wants to believe that he went someplace better, that's all. I wanted to get everyone together, to meet you when you came. But everyone's gone their separate ways now. Sorry. So the children of Etro have finally been eradicated. triumphant return <sighs> you again buzz off hope he does like to talk that one but jeepers that was some showdown didn't go like i thought how so okay pop quiz you get a special treat if you can tell me who showed noel the oracle drive recording I'm guessing you? Boy, I really underestimated the Shadow Hunter. I never expected he'd sabotage the prophecy himself. After you went to all that trouble to set it up, my heart bleeds for you. Hey, don't get me wrong. I didn't want it to go down any more than you. I'm happy it didn't. The world in that prophecy wasn't real. It was just a pretty fake. Like this god of yours, Benavelza, you know he's not omniscient. There are some things even he can't see. Things he can't see? Things like this? Oh, you're sharp as a knife, aren't you? When did you get to know so much about things? Still, I wonder if God knows his servant has her own agenda. You don't know what you're talking about. Welcome back. Once upon a time, Noel was one of the leaders. He helped us in the struggle against the chaos. When the Order took the reins of power, he went underground, but he didn't disappear. He worked from the shadows to help keep the peace. If the prophecy in the Oracle Drive is true, then maybe I should have died. That would be the best if it brings out the best possible future for everyone. I'm not so sure about that. The moment you die, you'll have failed in your mission as savior. And that, in turn, means you could not save Noel's soul. What would happen to him then? You're saying those images in the Oracle Drive weren't real? Those scenes where everyone looked so happy and safe? They were no more than just a pretty fake. They were just pictures. There's no way to see into the hearts of the people you saw in them. Vanille and Fang turned into a giant crystal pillar, and together they held up an entire world. We were all supposed to be in it together, but in the end, the entire burden fell on their shoulders. So you see, they have to be helped. We don't have any choice. We owe them.
That's odd. Why isn't anyone answering the phone? They worked for so long, it's as if nothing can hold their interest anymore. They've already seen and done everything. Now they just go through the motions. Talking to. Thank goodness. My name is Louise and I'm being chased by some people. You're being chased? All right, stay calm. Do you know where you are? Um, I'm by the North Station, right outside the graveyard. Still after you? Oh, is that you again? The girl who answered earlier? Those people chasing me? I lost them once, but they're back! Looks like they don't know when to give up. Where are you? Do you see anything familiar around you? I, I see the cathedral nearby, and then lots of people walking around the area. Scream for help to get their attention. I'll try, but I can't promise I'll make it there in time. Okay, I'll do that, but. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Don't you think the timing of the call was a little odd? It's like the phone rang when I got close. Maybe they have eyes on that place. I think you should go and see if she's okay, though. She sounded scared. All right. She said she could see the cathedral. That must mean the south of the city. Are you okay? Oh, thank goodness. I was hoping you'd answer. I'm sorry I ran away without waiting for you. I'm just glad you're all right. What happened? Well, I managed to get away from those people from before, but now... Uh, I think I'm lost. Let me get this straight. You're not hurt, just lost. 
And they're not chasing you anymore? The people that were after you before? Yes, thank you. I'm all right now. Look around you. Do you see any landmarks? Can you describe what you see? Um, I see... I see a bunch of shops nearby. How far from the South Station are you? Pretty far, I think. I didn't think about where I was going. I just ran. It's kind of messy here with a bunch of little streets. All right, I'll come find you. Stay there. Don't move an inch. Okay, I'll, I'll stay here. And, um... Yeah? I promise this isn't a hoax. You might not believe me, but I really need your help. I swear I'm telling the truth. I'll be waiting for you. I hope you'll come and find me. If you don't come, I... <sighs> Louise? Louise! What was she trying to tell me? I realize this is out of the blue, but, uh, you don't happen to be looking for a little girl named Louise. I am. How did you know that? Well, a good guess. I've fallen for her old pranks myself once or twice. Pranks? Yeah, she's a bored little girl with too much time on her hands. No one around here takes her seriously anymore. Think about it, I mean, she's been living here for several hundred years. Several hundred years. I mean, how easily could she get lost? Of course. Just because she sounds like a child. No child in this world is truly a child any longer. And even if she is lost, I mean, it's not as though she's hurt or in any kind of danger or something. Eh, I'm sure someone will help her out. Hope, what do you think? This is just another one of her famous pranks. The way she got cut off seemed real. She could have done that herself, for all we know. Just to add to the drama. There was something in her voice, a real... Desperation. Whatever the case, I'm gonna find her. She's somewhere far from the South Station. Did she say messy little streets? She has to be talking about Old Town. I think that's our best bet. Her tears make me remember things. What happened here? A girl was kidnapped from the area. The order has been summoned to investigate, and the whole thing is causing quite a commotion. A girl? Does her name happen to be Louise? Yes. Do you know her? Yes. Who took her? That bunch of heretics. You know, that rowdy group that was recently causing all the trouble in town. Oh, they must have drugged her. It all happened in the blink of an eye. The children of Etro are still up to their games, I see. Where could they take her when no one would find her? Perhaps they're hideout in the inner warren. The Order seems to think that's the case. But no one knows when, or even if, they'll take action. Why not? Her life is at stake. Everyone around here knows Louise. I don't know if you're aware of this, but she has a reputation for being the girl who cries wolf. Everyone's worried that this may just be another prank. This whole thing could be staged. It seems Louise has gotten herself into real trouble this time. People witnessed her being snatched up by the heretics. Maybe what started out as a prank got out of hand, and there was nothing she could do about it. But we can't disregard the small chance that this could all be a trick of hers. What do you think? Maybe that's why she was made their target. Even if she disappeared, they knew everyone would just think it's Louise being Louise. The Order has closed the investigation. That's the end of that. But if she really was taken by the children of Etro, it's not going to end well for her. Yeah. We all know how it'll play out if we don't find her soon. 
Let's head to the Warren and see if we can save her before it's too late. I've come to pray. How awful! There's never a day anymore. Not too bad here. This is Luxarian's North Station. The trains here shuttle back and forth between Luxarian and Yusnan the city that never sleeps. There is another station in Luxarian, South Station. The trains there will take you to either of these two locations. The Wildlands, where you can enjoy fresh air, nature, and friendly faces. Or the Dead Dunes, a desert abundant with hidden treasures. Go ahead and board the train. <laughs> 